Hello, this is Steve Shaw, and it's the end of the day, and I'm going to do one of my all-time favorite things with acrylic pour painting, and that is, I believe it's called a dirty flip cup. I have lots of extra paint left over, some white, some turquoise, platinum, black and teal. I don't know if I have any yellow left. Let's see. Nope, nope, nope. So those are my leftover colors. So this is one of my favorite things to do. Oh, wait, I am going to put a little bit of um, three-in-one oil in my colors. Boom, right there. A little bit on the top. I'll put a little bit in the white. What I love about doing the, the last pour of the day is it's kind of like you can't mess up or you're just kind of playing with it. If you mess up, who cares? You know, the, the, the canvas, you can always paint over it again later. And by giving up control or not really caring, um, a lot of times you'll end up with a really, really beautiful painting that you wouldn't have done before. So I'm gonna do things in reverse. Normally I'd put a layer of white. Guess what? I'm gonna put a little layer of black. I'm a rebel. Then I'm gonna go with some teal. You know what? I'm not even gonna think about it. I'm gonna put all of this teal in here. Okay, done with the teal. I'm gonna put a pretty good layer of the white because I've just got a good bit of white. That sank almost right to the bottom of my mixing cup. Um, so it means that's nice and heavy. Okay, boom, see ya. That was all of that metallic platinum. It's really silver if you ask me. A little more of this light blue. And I'm gonna do a couple of, oh, pfft, just pour it in there, Steve, get rid of it. All right, all that's gone. Oh man, do I do all the black? That's a lot of black in there. I'm gonna do most of it. I know, I know what you're saying. It's gonna be too dark. Nope, I'm doing the whole thing. All right, that's it. We've got about how many ounces in there? About 16 ounces of paint. And this is what it looks like. I'm gonna take my canvas. It's a 16 by 20 canvas. Flip cup. This is more like flip bucket. I'm gonna let it sit for a second. And this is where universes are created. And this is my favorite part. I'm just gonna wow let's just look at that for a minute let that settle in all right a lot obviously a lot of dark over here and a lot of light over here almost like a little yin yang thing going on I'm gonna start moving around to get some good coverage on my canvas whoa I got a lot of paint on here I'm going to get down in that corner yep move it Boom, nice and fast. Wow, you can see that coming through. Get my edge there. It's a little dark, but it's also really pretty. Okay. I'm going to just touch these edges a little bit to smooth them out. Back up here. Get a little more on this front edge. Ooh, got something in here. Okay. And a little bit more in the corner down here. And I believe, yes, I've got all the edges covered, which is nice. Wow, it's really pretty. It did get really dark um, up in this corner up here, but I'm okay with that. Um, I'm gonna wipe some of the paint off my hands, hit this bad boy with a torch, and we'll see if we can get more cells coming out. But cell, there's some pretty cells happening over here and over here, so let's see what the torch will do to it. Always be uh, careful with your torch. Make sure there's nothing in the general vicinity that can uh, catch on fire. Oh, did you see that like magic? Because all these beautiful black cells just came up. Wow. And 
and there we go. I'm going to leave it at that. Wow, a bunch of beautiful, beautiful cells there. Wow, marble and cells all together. I'm going to put that guy right there. All right. That was just a quick flip cup at the end of the day. I really appreciate you watching. Uh, feel free to leave a comment down below. And if you like the content, please hit subscribe. Also, uh, all the paintings I make, or almost all the paintings I make, are for sale at my Etsy store, including this one. So uh, go to Etsy.com and do a search for Steve Shaw. Thanks for watching.